The inconvenient truth of life is that the things that are worth having require effort. It's the proof of work idea that you have to invest time and energy in something. And then that also directly correlates to how much you enjoy it, right? So if things are given to you easily, you don't appreciate them, right? Like water, when it's just out of the faucet right there, doesn't hold much value. But if you're in the Sahara Desert and you can't get access to it, it's pretty much the most important thing there is, right? So like scarcity, abundance, availability, these things all tie in to how you appreciate things, how you value them, right? So when it comes to health, you think you can just like buy something and help you. And I mean, in some cases, if you're mineral de de deficient and you need magnesium and you take magnesium, like you will immediately feel it. So, I mean, I guess that's maybe an exception here, but you have to think long-term with your health. You can't just buy pills or supplements or powders, even though I literally sell them and recommend them to people. You can't only just buy those. You have to use those to supplement a whole food, real food, home cooked food, ideally diet, as well as daily activity. Walking, exercise, lifting heavy objects, stressing your muscles, your joints, your tendons, your ligaments. All the things that you probably know you're supposed to do, but it's easy to just like go on your phone and lay down and watch Netflix or whatever and not do it. So what you actually have to do is you have to figure out a way to create a habit around doing hard things. If you can get good at doing hard things, even get enjoyment out of them, even get a high out of doing hard things, all of those things like health and not being in pain and looking great and feeling great and whatever, all those things you will get and you will also value them, okay? This is the duality of life and health. You have to make, you could say, hard choices to have an easy life later. If you make easy choices now that are convenient, you're gonna have a hard life later, right? So it goes, let's see, make sure I get this right. It's hard choices, easy life. Because you do the hard things, right? Easy choices, the path of least resistance of convenience, you will have a hard life later because you will deal with the consequences of those easy choices.